Etsy friends, my name is Janae and today I've partnered with Etsy for another how-to video and this time we are covering all things work from home related. Now more than ever it is most important to make that space that you are spending so much time in working and living as comfortable and inspiring as possible and I've got a few fun tips just to show you how I did that in my space. All right, let's jump into this video. The focus of today's video is gonna be all about maximizing the space you already have and making it as functional as possible. And the best part is that all of these things are possible while supporting small business owners who are creating beautiful items and selling them on Etsy. In my situation, I live in an apartment with two roommates and I do not have my own private office space. However, I do have a closet that wasn't really being used for anything. And so I'm gonna be converting that into an office space today I want to jump in to the basics before anything else you're definitely going to want to start off with an actual workstation I chose to go with this gorgeous custom wood floating desk that I was able to get cut the exact size of my closet and I absolutely love how it turned out it really does maximize the space in my closet because I have so much storage space underneath and it's just not bulky and gave me that clear clean look that I was going for. I wanted to make sure we had some type of shelving going on and found this gorgeous pegboard that I thought was so unique. We've all seen pegboards, we've all seen floating shelves, and I love how this Etsy seller combined the two and I'm so excited to style that. And then lastly, because my office space is going to be in my bedroom and I definitely wanna be able to step away from work, I really wanted to create some sort of divide and I'm gonna be using some linen curtains as a partition. And there are so many small business owners on Etsy selling their gorgeous handmade curtains and these ones just turned out beautiful. I am obsessed with them. First, I wanted to focus on functional items for my desktop and I found this amazing sustainably made laptop stand. I've seen these before but they're usually plastic so I love that this one was wood and super easy to put together. And then I went ahead and got an external keyboard and a mouse all of that time on the tiny laptop definitely isn't great for my hands and Etsy happened to have handmade mouse pads as well and I love the green color of this mouse pad I think it is absolutely gorgeous I then found this beautiful ceramic vase if you look closely you can see it has this natural dimple um, texture on it and I think it's absolutely beautiful now moving on to this unique pegboard shelving situation I was I was so excited to style these shelves because Etsy is filled with so many beautiful, unique little decorate items. And I found this arch vase that has this black rainbow on it. And I'm so looking forward to keeping fresh flowers in here. Also, plants are a gal's best friend, so I had to make sure they were all over the shelving unit. And I found this little handmade ceramic pot with these blue dots that I thought was gorgeous. And just when you think you know everything that's on Etsy, you get surprised like I was. You guys, look at these super cute miniature cacti. Have you ever seen anything more adorable? Because I have not. This particular Etsy seller provides the cacti, the sand, and little pots for you. Adding plants to your office space is a great way to let the outdoors in, and while you're just deep in work, you can have a little bit of the outside life inside. Additionally on these shelves, I wanted to add a nice candle, and this one was an easy addition because it's in this beautiful amber jar, and that perfectly aligned with the kind of natural, neutral tones I wanted to bring in and it just smells divine and this glass is definitely going to be reused and to pair with that candle there's this beautiful matchstick holder with the speckled design and this gold strip I think it's so pretty who knew Etsy also sold matches to put in the match holder next I wanted to go beyond this desk area and find ways to personalize it and tie it all together and 
and also for any Zoom calls I have. It'll be nice to have a cute little setup in my background. I really wanted to add in some personal touches by incorporating some special moments from my life. And I found a really fun way to do that with these half moon wooden pieces made by an Etsy shop that I've actually followed for a really long time. And it's a black owned business and all of her creations are just gorgeous and so unique. Then there's this stunning brass and wood handmade lamp. I really couldn't believe that someone handmade this. I just, that blows my mind. And they even go out of their way to wrap the cord and disguise it and make it blend into your space a little bit better. We are missing a major key factor when it comes to office design, and that is organization. First, I wanna highlight this super cute milk crate. I absolutely love the color more neutrals but it blends in nicely with the space and i thought this would be a perfect place to store my records now moving on to paperwork after just recently filing my taxes i definitely want a strategy in storing my paperwork other than just one giant sandwich bag i really shouldn't put myself out there like that but on Etsy, there is a hand crafter that makes these beautiful leather straps that you can use to hang um, file folders, which I thought was so unique. I've never seen that before. Speaking of leather goods, I found another solution that is super convenient, and that is cord organizers. We all have them. It's just the way it is but it's no fun detangling cords all of the time. And I thought these were not only super cute, but they're very functional and you just easily wrap your cord around and snap it closed. And voila, you have your cords organized and easy to grab. Then there are these wooden organizers that are really minimal and a unique look to this space, but they're a great way to store little knickknacks that you don't want piling up in other places. Now I have some additional wall space on this side of my closet. I'd love to use this space to add a little memo board. And this is created actually by the same seller who designed the Half Moon paper holders. And she also makes this memo board, which I think is a great way to either have a motivational message or any reminders that I need for the day. The very last addition is going to be stationary items. And you can find those items on Etsy. Are you surprised? <laughs> And I found this really nice calendar that was right up my alley because it lets you not only organize your tasks by day, but it also allows you to kind of gather your thoughts and it has a little section for your weekly intentions and what you wanna focus on. Then there's this grateful heart journal. Focusing on gratitude can really keep me grounded and I hope that it can keep you grounded. And I think this journal is a great way to do that. And she makes it super easy for you to write down down your gratitude list and gives you nice prompts and there's beautiful imagery inside and it's just a really great find. All right, those are all of the items, but let's do a tour of the space and see how it turned out. I am absolutely obsessed with how this came together and cannot believe that my boring old closet is now an office space, all with the help of Etsy. Definitely let me know down below what you guys think and what you can do in your space. All right, you guys, that's it for this how-to video. I really hope that you found it helpful and also inspiring to make the spaces around you work best for you. If you'd like to shop any of the items featured in today's video, be sure to check the description box down below. And if you have any questions, don't be afraid to drop those down below as well. And I will see you guys next time.